It's the distance, nobody has died so far. Six missions left. Let's just get straight to it. Is everybody geared up? Yeah, they are. Hey, Li Shu. You coming to join me like you did last time? Which was kind of weird. It's usually Io who, who joins me for the videos. What are you swapping out? Is it an exchange program or something? Oh, no, she's gone. Well, she is a cat. They are fickle. Oh, I've got the decimator. I... Sure as heck did not mean to do that. Uh, yeah, I did not want to be using the decimator with princess. I don't think that plays to her strengths. Right, there is... There's definitely a tank up there. And I needed him crippled, so that's why I did that rather strange attack there with Rickety Rick. We've got to... We've got to make a move here. Uh... Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. Who's got dog? George, you do. Right, let's move you there. Let's do this. Okay, so Princess is safe, but she can't get through. Oh, boy. Right, we need to stun you or something. Good. We need to get you guys moved somewhere. Nope. Can't use guts. I hate using tools on uh, last stand. But what am I going to do? What am I going to do? Okay, those guys all have to be affected. I've got to go here. He is potentially a problem. Now he's not. Yeah, that really that really sucks getting a poor princess injured. It's not very not very helpful at all. Uh Yeah, do that. These guys aren't crippled or anything. I am concerned that they're going to start chewing on Rick. Nope, don't get a chance. Let's say goodbye to you. Okay, so. Pretty rough. Pretty rough. But nobody died. Nobody died, so uh, uh, we're still on track. I've definitely got somebody else injured. Yes, it is Carol. Um, yes. Do I want to do that? Take out all the raiders. Kind of tempted to do that. Yep, let's do this. Take on some raiders. Obviously, there's going to be walkers there as well. Bright shield is good against both. We should be able to stun these guys. Wow. Okay, stun these guys, he says. Not stunning anything. Uh, let's get you on fire, get you crippled. Let's get you on fire. Now these guys are all um, in annoying places. I, I kind of want to be able to run past them. But we've got a bit of a problem there. Damn it, would you stun somebody? Thank you. Okay, we got 
a walker potentially coming for us. Whoa, Corey, what the heck? Okay, that was that was super weird. Okay, we've got walkers coming in every single turn. This is a problem for us. Okay, so T-Dog can just get the heck out of there. George cannot. Maggie. Uh, what can we do? What can we do? No, stop trying to... So you are the problem, are you? Well, George has got to... He's, he's, he's kind of got to get out of here, hasn't he? I'm kind of concerned because I can't see where this guy can go. I think he has to go around the tail lift. So he should... I mean, let's just be double sure. We should be able to put him there and be okay. Maggie... I can't actually quite see where she's going. Oops. Okay, excuse me. I'm just going to pause it. Uh, the screen has faded. Bear with me a sec. Okay, normal service has resumed. My battery was just really, really low, uh, and that just meant that the screen went dim, so apologies for that. Uh, but we're back, we're back, we're back. It's plugged in. And I think we're... Uh, we're kind of getting ready to make our escape. Now, obviously, the humans are alive. So the escape bar hasn't made an appearance. When it does, you better bet that we are getting out of here ASAFP. We've got Joshua over there, who is now fighting for his life. All we've got to do is hang on until that fight is over. Okay, we're going to get our shooters cuddled up in the corner there. We're going to keep on hitting targets. We're probably not going to kill them. But we can slow them down. Okay, we've got lots of these guys cooking. That's it's kind of a good and a bad thing. It means that if they attack T-Dog, he might well get hurt. There we go. The desperate fight is over. Salutations to a fallen fellow survivor. But uh, he was a bad guy. So we're not that upset. Obviously, I've got the double reward on, the distance booster for the distance, hence we're getting double rewards. That's because we've got a brand new seasonal challenge. Um, got a bruiser weapon up for grabs, which looks like a, a sort of a warhammer, basically. Kind of crazy, you would only really use those if you were mounted on a horse, but uh, okay. It's a Warhammer. It, it looks looks pretty decent. If I what does it do? You can hit you can hit multiple enemies with it. I, I I think you can hit five enemies with it, which is pretty good. I think it's got some pretty good stats. Is it better than my favorite bruiser weapon, which is the riot shield, which lets you herd walkers? It's probably not, but. Um, I, I do remember just sort of glancing at the stats and thinking, hmm, okay, all right, that looks pretty credible. The other weapon that is up for grabs is the final prize, which is, um, it's a scythe. Well, yeah, sort of scythe, sickle kind of thing for scouts. Looks really bizarre as a scout weapon. Looks quite cumbersome. I mean, there's there, it wouldn't be very practical in air quotes, real life. Um, but the actual stats look look pretty nuts. Again, it can hit five enemies, if, if I recall. Um, potentially ten, because you get an extra attack. The charge attack is like a free attack, which is just nuts. So you're going to be able to hit a lot of... get a lot of enemies all at once with a scout attack. And, and of course, scouts are the heaviest hitting, naturally the heaviest hitting class. So, it looks pretty impressive. Um, I don't think that it can silence 
you know, I don't think it reduces threat or anything like that. I like weapons that do that. Especially scout weapons, uh, things like the Sawtooth Blade or the, the Ruby Present, whatever it's called. Uh, you know, they, they, yeah, yeah, they have that silencing ability. They take down threat, which makes them just an absolute joy to use. I don't think that that Scythe has that. But again, you could hit up to 10 enemies per turn. You know, with an attack that has the, the power of a scout behind it. Maybe even Survivalist Rick, you know? He uh, he has extra damage for his charge attacks. Yeah, I, I, I can definitely... It, it looks really interesting. It looks really, really... On paper, it sounds fantastic. You never quite know how these things are going to work out when you actually try them. So sometimes weapons that look incredible, in theory, turn out to be a little disappointing. And vice versa, sometimes you can think, oh, I, I don't know if this weapon's going to be so great, and wow, it blows you away. But yeah, it, I'm, I'm kind of glad. I think... You know, I think I think that some of the prizes that we got in this com this current Guild War are a bit lacklustre, but those seasonal event prizes look really, really interesting. So keen to give those a go. Um, where are we now? I think we've got three missions left. Do we have three missions? One, two, three. Yes. So that's the end for this video. We'll see if we can make it right the way to the end without losing anyone. But for now, thank you for watching.